Hello again, this is Jared Two Speaker, and today I'm talking about being born to live. Yes, born to live. We are not, as you have heard many times, we are born to die. We are not born to die. We are born to have eternal life. So it would be wise to stop telling children when a loved one die that they went to heaven. Heaven is not in the sky. It's not on another planet. Heaven is within you. It is here, now, now, here. All you have to do is tap, in, tap into it. We are infinite, eternal, universal, immortal beings inside of a mortal body. This body will expire one day, but the being, the eternal you that is within it will live forever. But <laughs> you have to make that choice if you want to live forever. That is why you are in the body, to choose whether or not you want to have eternal life. You have, like Pinocchio, life. But in order for you to become real, your spirit has to be quickened. Pinocchio had to be um, brave and uh, selfless. He had to have courage to become alive. He had to go, he had to dig deep. He had to go deep within himself to wake up and to become a real boy. And that is what we have to do. We have to go within ourselves so that we are able to make the decision because if you only have life and you are not awakened, you don't know that you are asleep. You don't know that you are spiritually dead. And that's where you have to get to. You have to die a spiritual death while you are in the body so that you can have eternal life. You may come through this life in a different body many, 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 many times. Well, it may take someone else a few times. But nevertheless, you have to evolve to that point where you wake up and are able to make the choice to say, take me there. I'm ready to go to the next level and be quickened, spiritually awakened. So we are not born to die, but to have life eternal. And that's my word for today. And the only way you could do that is through some form of meditation and opening up the right hemisphere of your brain and uh, connecting with the consciousness, Christ consciousness, universal consciousness, whatever you want to call it, within you. And that is my word for today. Until next time, love, light, peace. And please meditate.